So if you're the host of a Zoom meeting or someone who's been allowed to record the Zoom meeting, you'll see in the bottom of the screen, you're gonna see a record button. However, if you don't want folks to know or you're not given permission to record, you can do it a different way. I'm gonna show you how to do this on a Mac today. So even if you have permission to record, when you start the recording, you'll see in the upper left, everyone will see the little red dot, see that it's recording the, the uh, interaction. So if you don't want that, the way you do it on a Mac is to use QuickTime Player. So this is free software. It exists on every Mac. QuickTime Player, it's a little strange that they call it a player uh, because you can use it to record too. So let's head on down to Applications and we're gonna pull up QuickTime Player. Now, QuickTime Player is a little confusing because it doesn't open any windows when it starts. So all you're gonna see across the top of the screen is the QuickTime Player listed in the bar. So go ahead and click on File, and then you're gonna do a new screen recording. So you can go through and check out the different options if you want to say, just, just capture just the window where people are speaking or maybe even just part of the window where people are speaking. Uh, you can make that choice and then come over and click the record button. And now it's recording and you should see on the top, you'll see this icon here, just a circle with a square inside it. That square is your stop button. And once you're ready to stop recording. However, the folks on the other side, I guess I'm still recording this call, let me close that out. So even though it's no longer being recorded in Zoom, it's still being recorded in QuickTime Player and nobody sees that on the Zoom call. So once you're done, you just click the stop button up here. QuickTime Player will open the video and you can see here I've got 29 seconds of this video here of exactly what I was talking about, including past the point where I stopped the Zoom recording. So that's how you can record a video without having the record button or without wanting people to know that you've clicked the record button in your Zoom meeting. I'd love it if you subscribe to this channel if you enjoyed this video.